This is Night Rebel, six over four. She's sired by Rebel Red, and she's a March of 04 model. Perfect editor on her. You saw her mother in here Saturday Night Live. Night Rebel is being bred to um, Unbreakable, and we'll show you her super up calf in a minute, owned by H&J. Here's those white base horns with the black tips again. Night Rebel. Here's Bullet Fire's little heifer by Fielder, number 23, and April 5th. Bullet Fire Fielder Heifer. Here's Night Rebel's little baby, number 135. Night Rebel Super Up. This big old guy will go in our meat program. He doesn't have enough color to be a herd sire, so he's certainly got the body to be a meat program. This is Double Secret Probation. She's an 05 <clears throat> cowboy man daughter. She had a little horn damage as a calf, but none of her calves have any horn damage. She is bred to calf this year still, and she's keeping it a secret what she's going to have still. Double secret probation is out of Believe It, one of our seed stock uh, cows. This is our last cow left to calf that's carrying a super up calf, owned by Dean and Mary Horky. Double secret probation. This is Bullet Star, 56 over 1. She's a June 01 uh, edition by Bullet, which is a stealth son, out of Superstar, which is a measles Super Ranger, Starlight Gal, Butler Blend. <coughs> um, Bullet Star has an unbreakable calf at side. We'll show you in just a minute. This is a Bubba daughter, ear tag 62, born May 5th. She's out of a two-year-old that we'll show you in a minute. Dos Rojo times Bubba, number 62. Here's the mama to 62, Dos Rojo, 26 over 8. She was born March of 08, sired by Rebel Red, out of a cow we just showed you named Double Secret Probation. Dos Rojo belongs to Dean and Mary Horky. Look at the pretty brindling she's got all over her face and brindling coming out more and more on her hip. Dos Rojo and her calf. Sorry we haven't gone alphabetically in this pasture, but we just had to take the cows as they served us, served them to us. Here's Rebel Red now and he's in love, so we're going to have a bit of a problem really showing you how great this bull is. He's showing you what a good job he does. Uh, Rebel Red is a Tabasco son. He's 11 years old uh, this year, and he's still giving us tons of body, tons of horn, and great disposition calves. Look at the length of body on this guy. He won the Trophy Horn Showcase two years running in his age class. Uh, produces a lot of that horn in such beautiful disposition. Tabasco son out of a cow named Hot Bale. Rebel Red. This bull is so gentle, you can sit on him out in the pasture. He's just super nice, super friendly. Rebel Red. This is 7 over 9, a Rosie Ranch Connection daughter sired by Shockwave. Shockwave produces our corkscrew twist horns on these girls. And you can see her horns are starting to twist already. She's a March 09 heifer being bred to Rebel Red. 7 over 9, Rosie Ranch Connection Shockwave. This is 47 over 9, Reba's Breaker. She's an unbreakable daughter born April 17th of 09 out of a troubadour daughter named True Hearts. We love the pretty lacy face on this little heifer. Bring bread to Rebel Red for her first calf. 47 over 9, Reba's Breaker. This is 86 over 8, Unbreakable Jewel. This is a two-year-old. She wasn't born until June of 08. We bred her anyway, and she's about to have a baby. 
unbreakable jewel ready for her first calf 86 over 8 we put our yearlings with the bull every year ones that are born this late in the year sometimes don't calf this heifer is certainly going to calf this is brassy shadow 7 over 1 701 she's march of 07 She's sired by a son of Rebel Red named Top Brass out of a brindle cow we'll show you later named Shadow's Patches. Brassy Shadow is doing a great job. We'll show you her calf next. This is her bull calf by private edition, except now he's a steer. And he was born April, 06, April 6th of this year. Very big bodied. She's given it all to him, which we really like for our cows to give it to the babies rather than holding it all in their own flesh and she's doing a great job he'll go in our meat program this is breaking bessie 28 over 6 she's a march of 06 heifer she's a shamrock unbreakable she has the perfect bag she's out of a cow named true hearts bessie and which gives her overwhelmer on the bottom side and vj tommy on the top side we love her lacy face the superman progeny or the overwhelmer progeny has a lot of this lacy face and the twist to her horn. Breaking Bessie being bred back to Rebel Red. And we'll show you her calf and you'll see why we took her back to Rebel Red. Here's her little Rebel Red daughter now. Heifer 49, born April 20th. The white ear tags indicate our little girls. The yellow ear tags indicate our little boys. And this little Rebel Red daughter is already sprouting those horns. And she's going to be bred back to the same bull to make another one just like her. This is Classy Lady, owned by H and J. Classy Lady is a February of 06 um, female, sired by Unbreakable, out of a cow named Night Rebel, which has the Rebel Red blood. Classy Lady possesses a great body, lots of horn, and that horn turns white at the base, causing her horn to give you lots of extra horn growth. She just had a little private edition uh, bull calf, uh, red that may turn brindle. She's not showing us today where it is. Classy lady being bred back to Rebel Red. This is one of our grandmas, Cowgirl Lace. She is extra, extra friendly <laughs> and has been a great producer for us for many years. She was born in 95, sired by a bull named Conniger, out of a cow that won the world, Cowgirl Kate. She's loaded with horn, loaded with personality, and now she wants to show you her beautiful body, too. Cowgirl Lace. And this is her little bundle of joy this year. Ear tag 170, sired by Rebel Red, and we gave her back to Rebel Red for the obvious reasons. This is a little bull out of a cow like her, sired by Rebel Red, colored like he is, that we'll watch as a potential herd sire. 170, Cowgirl Lace, Rebel Red. This is calf 121, sired by Rebel Red, out of a cow we're gonna show you in a minute, named Dixie Girls Wave. Look at the body on this guy. This guy is the kind of bull that we don't keep as a bull. Uh, he's not a potential herd sire, so we'll steer him very early and turn him for our meat program. And this is his mama, Dixie Girls Wave. She's an 06 model, sired by Shockwave, out of a cow named First Snow Dixie Girl. Dixie Girls Wave has lots of body, lots of color, and loaded with horn, and a super position. You saw the job she's doing on her calves, Dixie Girls Wave. This is Laced Hot Shot. Laced Hot Shot, shot <laughs> is an 05 model, Roundup Hotshot Daughter out of Cowgirl Lace that we showed you just a minute ago. She has this beautiful Rebel Red Daughter, number 20, already growing out the horn, born in April, April Fool's Day as a matter of fact. Laced Hotshot has a lot of body, we'll show you that in just a second. Very long, tall bodied female built for travel and certainly doing a great job milking too. Laced hot shot.